Hey guys, welcome back. And we have Tim James back, aka the health hero. He's the founder of chemicalfreebody.com. He's also the host of Health Hero Show. And we are really excited. Today we are talking about how to maximize and boost your energy naturally. We want to know how to get more energy. We're going to be discussing things like what are biophotons. So if you don't know what that is, we're going to talk about it today. We're going to talk about how to get in more living foods. And welcome, Tim James. Chantel, I'm back again. (laughs) And we love having you here. (laughs) Yeah. Well, I really want to, I'm really excited to talk about boosting energy because boy, do we have an energy deficiency. It's it's literally a national crisis today with, you know, and it breaks my heart too, because I, you know, I was talking to a guy not too long ago and he's like, I literally come home, I have a six-year-old son and I, I have no energy to play with him. And that is a, it's just a, it's a tragedy, you know? And so watching him be able to come home and he called me up, he's like, Hey, I have, I have tons of energy now. And I'm playing catch with my son, like stuff like that. Like I get emotional and then I'm like, I have a tear in my eye. And that's why I love doing this work. Mm. Well, I'm so excited. I'm going to start with a question today. And I feel like a lot of people feel this way. This is question is from Cedric in Sarasota, Florida. He says, I'm so tired all the time. I have no energy. I sleep eight hours a day. I do intermittent fasting. I eat in a four hour window from four to eight every day. I eat 80% clean. And on the weekends, I eat whatever I want, but I have no energy. I feel like I'm in a rut. Ah, and that's all he said, Cedric in Sarasota, Florida. So I'm sure a lot of listeners feel this way. Let's kind of peel apart what could be going on and what's really kind of zapping his energy. Okay. Well, I don't know if we're going to have time to get through all this in 20 or 30 minutes, because when we have people, you know, if we look at the basics, like, um, you know, number one, we want to get people detox first. Okay. We have got to get the gut, the pathway of elimination clean so we can get maximum absorption of nutrients. Cedric might have malabsorption issues, right? He might just have a hard time absorbing nutrients. Like a lot of people, most people are maybe absorbing 10 to 30% of what goes through the gut. That's like with turmeric. That's why they put black pepper with it to have that piperine or piperine in there to increase the absorption of the turmeric, right? So, um, so that's number one. We get the pathway of elimination cleaned out, and then we flood it with good bacteria so we get good digestion and good uh, absorption of nutrition. Um, we're drinking a lot of water. That's very important to hydrate the cells so the cells can absorb nutrients properly. We wanna make sure that we're getting high quality fats and fatty acids that are not cooked so that we can build a good lipid or fat membrane around the cell so the cell can get nutrients in and get waste matter out. Um, And we would be looking at things like avocados, flaxseed oil, chia seed, chia seed oil, um, red raspberry seed extract, um, things like this, sprouted nuts, high quality fats, sprouted beans. These things are some of the really good. And those fats, when they're sprouted, are already broken into fatty acids. So the body doesn't have to labor to convert. The other thing we have to look at um, is cellular inflammation. If we're inflamed on a cellular level, the nutrients can't get in well and the waste matter can't get out, right? So that's another thing. That's why we have that, um, well, that turmeric product, the turmeric 100, because it literally goes through the mucous membrane into the body and within five minutes douses the entire cardiovascular system and all these little cells with microscopic um, natural curcuminoids, which is the main ingredient in the anti-inflammatory ingredient in turmeric root that, that will reduce inflammation so that now the, the nutrients can get in and get out. Um, so on a, on a nutritional point, we have to get all that stuff working and look at all that. And then we have to look at what's he putting in, right? So, you know, People say they eat healthy, but I would actually have to see what are you eating? Like if you say, I eat a salad, I want to know every single ingredient. I want to know, are you putting vinegar on that? Because if you are, the vinegar is disrupting your digestive juices and it's causing fermentation and gut rot. So a lot of people are using balsamic vinegar on salads because it tastes freaking delicious, but it's counterintuitive because it causes fermentation. It doesn't create digestion and assimilation. So that's part of proper food combining, which we'll do in a later talk. So we got to look at that because 85% of the nutrients are farmed out of the soil. So even if Cedric's eating organic now, um, he's going to be deficient, you know, because most likely those organic foods were grown in deficient soil. So he's going to have to supplement today. Um, 
supplements, supplementation is not a luxury anymore. It's a necessity just because of the soil degradation. That's why we have, we use our green 85, our flagship product for that because it replaces the 85% of nutrients missing in the soil less than a minute, makes it convenient for people. Now, beyond that, he said a bunch of other things like he sleeps eight hours, but what's the quality of his sleep? I don't know. We'd have to look at that because we have a national crisis, another one called shallow sleep syndrome. And if you're, this might, you might sleep eight hours, but you wake up freaking tired, right? So that we have to make sure he's got a good bed. We have to make sure he has good airflow, clean air when he's, when he's sleeping. Um, we have to, uh, we use things like essential oils and diffusers to make the, clean the air and put good things in the air so you can breathe better, like eucalyptus and peppermint and wintergreen and clove. And we rotate those oils at night. Um, I would also question, um, is his head within three foot of a light socket? If so, he's being exposed to electric low frequency and it's screwing up his cells. So there's harmonizers you can buy, or you can move the bed at least three foot away from that thing. Again, cracking the window at night. So we got to look at the sleep. Um, he's doing intermittent fasting. That's fantastic. Um, eating in the windows. He said on the weekends, he eats whatever the hell he wants. Well, you know, maybe what is that? You know, um, is he drinking alcohol? I don't know. So this is one of the things when people have issues like this, we have to go through step by step by step from the top of their head and work their way down to their toes and look at their lifestyle and their environment. And we slowly just check things off and improve this, check this, improve that, change this, change that um, until the, the scales tip and the immune system shoots up and he gets his energy back. So I don't know exactly what his issue is, but like I said, most people have malabsorption issues. They're not, they're not sleeping well because their environment's not good. Um, also, he would want to look into grounding or earthing. Very powerful. Um, the earth puts off a natural frequency, you know, hold up a compass and you'll tell the needle moves. Why is it moving? Well, there's something out there. And that natural frequency actually charges our cells and gives us energy. It's like a battery pack. So when we're walking around barefoot outside or laying in the grass and our skin's touching the grass and the soil, we are charging our bodies. In the millisecond that you break free of the earth, inflammation begins. And look at how we live today, Chantel. We live, we're in cars with rubber tires. We're wearing high heels and, 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 and shoes and basketball shoes and flip-flops. And we're, 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 we're insulating ourselves from mother nature. We live on, you know, first floor, second floor, third floor. We're living on beds up in the air, working in offices, concrete. We are disconnected from that vibrational frequency of the earth. And um, we've seen so many people reconnect to that reduces the inflammation and boom, they start sleeping better. The energy comes back. So there's a lot of thing that Cedric could do. And then other people could do that are suffering from, from constant fatigue, as you can see, uh, we just, you know, talked about a few of those just, just right now. Hey guys, I really want you to join our intermittent fasting and OMAD Facebook group. We're doing tons of giveaways right now for posting your before and after pictures and just for posting a question in there. We're giving away free protein shakes, some digest aid, all kinds of fun stuff. So please join our intermittent fasting and OMAD Facebook group. The link is in the show notes. That's great. Um, let me dive into the next question that we got in. This is from Kimberlina, which I love that name, in <laughs> Tampa, Florida. She said, I saw a video of your daily routine on Facebook, and I saw that you had two different saunas. Is that right? Were you at someone else's house, or were they both at your house? What is the difference between an infrared and traditional sauna, and what are the differences between them? I went to a spa this weekend. They had three different saunas, and I guess I just wanted to learn what is the difference between all of them. Okay. So there's different types of saunas. You have your regular like Finlandia sauna where it's, it just heats it up, right? And you get in there and it's hot and that's nice. Um, the problem with those is, is they, they are, you, if you have heart issues, you wouldn't want to go into those just like the doctor will tell you not to go into the hot tub because your, your the outside temperature will be too hot than your heart temperature and that can cause a heart attack or issues with your heart. So then we go to the next one, which are steam saunas. These are fantastic for the skin and your water-based organs like your bladder, and your kidneys. Um, steam saunas are awesome. And then the last one is infrared saunas, uh, which is my favorite. Infrared saunas actually penetrate you deeply. They heat you from the inside out. That's why it's okay. 
Um, but of course, always check with your doctor, but that's why it's okay for people that with heart issues, they can get into these, but you know, if you got little kids or elderly, you want to lower the temperature and, you know, lower temperature, longer stay. Um, but, um, these things are powerful. So I can't remember which, um, uh, what she saw on the Facebook post, but, um, maybe was she talking about you or me? Uh, me, I, I know I have a video out there and it's got me in one sauna and then it, I'm going, in. Okay. it's the one that I bought with you with the single one, yeah, so it's yeah, yeah. my regular infrared sauna that I have. Okay. And then the single one that I just sit in with the one person is what she's okay. talking about. So what, 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 what Chantel's talking about, see, I, I, I've been a sauna dealer. I'm very versed in saunas I, for, for almost nine years. And I had the big $5,400 wooden box sauna. It was awesome. It's, it's the best on the market market. I did my research, low to no EMFs, no ELFs, the electric low frequency that we're talking about before with the, the electrical lines, um, pro proper position for detoxification with the panels, no glues for off gassing, lifetime warranty. This is good, good sauna, right? I used it for eight and a half years. No problem. Until earlier this year, I ran into this little sauna and the technology blows away everything I've ever seen. These are literally, and that's what Chant Chantel got the little one because it's like 33 pounds. You just plug it into a 110. You can travel with it. It fits up into the side of a suitcase little deal. But the most important thing for me is it will actually raise my core temperature over double what all the other saunas will do. Now, if you look at Hippocrates, the father of Western medicine, remember that guy, let thy food be thy medicine, thy medicine be thy food. And Paramedes, these, both of these guys said, give me the power to create fever and I will cure all disease. So when we get sick with the flu, what does our body do? It creates a fever raises our core temperature, kills the virus. That's one of our defense mechanisms. And body's very intelligent. And it puts you down in bed to rest while it's doing it because it needs all the energy to whack out that virus. Now, with an infrared sauna, you can create an artificial uh, fever every single day, which will kill harmful organisms like viruses, bacteria, molds, yeast, fungus, and parasites, and mutagens, cancers, hate it, okay? Because it, it knocks them out. So, um, What's cool about this little sauna is, you know, a big sauna, a good one, maybe you're gonna raise your core temperature a degree, maybe a degree and a half, but with this little one, you can, 25 minutes, you can raise your core temperature 3.2 degrees. Up, if you're, you can stay into it for an hour, which I can't even work my way into that yet, um, you can raise it up to 4.2 degrees. I mean, this is tremendous. Like I have a, a client right now, her husband, glioblastoma brain cancer, decided to get the tumor removed, but didn't want to do the radiation and chemo, wants to do everything natural. He got one of the saunas and he's almost up to an hour a day with his head in it, trying to get up to that higher core temperature. Because, you know, when they remove the tumor, the tumor cells went everywhere, right? So he has tumor cells all over his body right now. And he's doing everything he can with, you know, sprouts and phytonutrients. We talked about Sephora thing and the sprouting episode and, and, you know, high vibe, high vibe foods and saunas and, and grounding and earthing and protecting the EMFs and ELF frequencies, he's doing everything he can because he wants to live. They got little children and stuff like that. He's, he's pretty young dude. So, and he's doing well with it. So that's the, hopefully that answers the question is that, um, uh, Chantel has two saunas. She has her old big box sauna and she's got this newer small uh, portable one that is infrared, but it's just, it's double the potency because they've, they just discovered these uh, processors and that can uh, make 98% pure infrared where the other saunas are at best, maybe 40 to 50%. Hey guys, I'm so excited. My new book, One Meal and a Tasting is out now. And if you order the book on Amazon, just the regular paperback edition, if you go in and make a review, you will get the audio book for free. Send a copy of your receipt to questions at chantelrayway.com and you'll get the audio book right away. So let's talk about anything else, kind of maybe three more reasons that people are really just feeling so tired, chronically tired, and they're just so fatigued. What could be some other issues people are having right now? Well, um, stress, stress. I was, <laughs> let's talk about stress. I mean, you know, <laughs> there's stress in the world today. There was stress before COVID. You know, if, you know, I know that statistically 74% of people are going to work for a paycheck. They don't like their job. They don't like their career. Okay, you need to like your career, right? Mm -hmm. And if and you're like, well, I'm stuck and I got bills and I, I got to work. I'm like, okay, well, you need to find something else. You need to put a half an hour a day into something else, 
right? Mm-hmm. Start getting your get, find something you like that you're passionate about, and 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 up your skill set so that you can get paid for it. There's always value. You want to make more money. You want to increase your value. Invest in yourself. It's always a six to ten x return when you invest in you. Um, maybe you have a stressed out relationship. Look how many people end up in divorce. It's like seventy percent, right? Mm-hmm. So if your relationship's not working, you're going to be stressed out. Stress is going to impede you from absorption of nutrients. That's why we teach our core four secrets. And core secret number four is doing breath work or breath exercises prior to eating a meal. Why do we do that? Because if you're in fight or flight mode, because you're stressed out about your job, stressed out about your career, stressed out about your relationship, stressed out about finances, stressed out about your your daughter, your son or something, or your, your parents are aging and they're having dementia or whatever it could be. Um, you got a crazy neighbor, who knows? Um, if you're stressed out, your body is in fight or flight mode. And when that happens, the blood actually leaves the organ systems and goes to your extremities to fight or flight. And you can't absorb, you can't digest your food really well. If you're not going to digest your food well, you're not going to get good nutrient absorption and you're going to be fatigued, right? Mm -hmm. So the first thing that I tell people like to boost your energy is just simply drink purified water. Your body's mostly water and 95% of people are low in water. As soon as you start pouring water into your body, and lots of it, purified, restructured water, especially if you're on city taps, you're going to boost your immune system, right? Mm-hmm. Going for walks, exercise, mini trampolines, uh, qigong exercises, these things get your body moving. That's going to increase your energy. Um, not eating breakfast. For those of you that are not type 2 diabetic, that are not anorexic and not bulimic, you avoid, you just do a liquid liquid meal in the morning. Like all I do is our greens. We do a green juice in the morning. Or you could do a nut milk with the greens if you need something heavier in the beginning. Stop eating breakfast, okay? That's it's 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 a game changer. Like I couldn't believe it when they were telling me this and being like, "Not eat breakfast, isn't that the most important meal of the day?" No, it it just it throws off your blood sugars. It's a disaster. It stops the detoxification process. Just wait till after 11 a.m. and then eat your heavy meals, and it's a game changer. Now for type two diabetics, they need to eat monolithically in the beginning one food like a big salad or quinoa by itself, and and then once the type two diabetes things handled, then they can, you know, replace the heavy meal with liquid too. So this is very important to, to that breakfast deal because that's a major energy booster. We also have to focus on sleep. Again, we were talking about Cedric, you know, good bed, essential oils, crack your window at night, grounding. There's grounding mats you can actually buy to stick on your uh, mattress and avoid the ELFs, the, uh, the light sockets within three foot or get a harmonizer. So, um, you know, and then replace what's missing in the soil. You got to flood the body with nutrients a couple times today with those green juices. Well, on our next episode, we have exciting news. Tim is coming back. And on our next episode, we are going to talk about food combining, food digestion, and how to actually get the nutrients from what you're eating into your bloodstream. So that's going to be coming up next. So don't go anywhere. And Tim, before we go, tell listeners where they can find you, where they can follow you. Uh, they can find me over at chemicalfreebody.com. Um, our, my podcast link is there. You can find the podcast Health Hero Show at on all the major platforms. And again, if people would like to try some of our products, just go to the products tab, go to the savings bundle so you can get a discount and then put the 5% discount code in at checkout, waste away and get a double discount and we have a double your money back guarantee on all products so there's no there's literally no risk to try them all right stay tuned <laughs>